guys doing today hello my kings and queens how are you guys doing today i hope that you guys are having a wonderful day we're doing okay over here thank you so much for asking i have mr e here today and today we're doing a test taste from mexico yay i am your host queen m from queen's life welcome back to my channel if you're new i hope that you consider hitting that subscribe button and the notification bell and if you're a returning member Thank you so much for stopping by so guys i wanted also to thank you for all the wonderful comments you guys leave me down below you know that i always try to answer each and every one of you so with that being said let's get started so the first one even though it does say um uh, i don't know how to pronounce it but it says japones right here i'm not sure how to pronounce that right there um it is a value pack i believe it has six packs to it individually like this but as always as i like to show you guys down here it does say that is a product of mexico so let's get started and see how this one tastes. Um, what is it? Is it like peanut, like peanuts? Mm. It's the way that it looks. It definitely smells like peanuts. Mm. Mm. Spicy. Spicy. Uh -oh. They're good, mm. but spicy. They're good. Mm. They are good. I don't feel any spice to it. Yes, there's a first kick to it. Oh, this looks like it's a nut within a nut. Look at the really way it powder. looks, guys. This is the way that it looks. You see that? Mm. That is the way that it looks. They are good, though. So, the second one that we have inside, there's 12 pieces, and it's called Pulpa Rindo, wow. with real fruit. <gasps> Try to say that 10 times. Ooh. Pulpa Rindo, 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 Pulpa Rindo. I don't know how many that was, but... <laughs> I am kind of scared because it does say hot and salted tamarind. Maybe it's, maybe it's like tamarind. I know. That's maybe what it the, is. Maybe it's the cousin of tamarind. It has 12 individual ones in there. Oh, and of course, let me show you the back. Here is a product of Mexico. And there's 12 packages that look like this. Mm. Pulparindo, 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 pulparindo. Mm -hmm. I guess, I don't know. Mm. Mexico got always got good stuff. Oh, what is this? Chewy? Oh, it's in my pen. Let me show them. Mmm, rather interesting. That's look at this. Look at that. Mm. Do you see this? Oh. Mm. Guys. Mm. Mm -mm. Wow. Sugar. Now they're taking a whole spoon of sugar. Tangy. Whoa. Mm -mm. It hits right there. Yeah. I'll be back. <laughs> It hits right there. Wow. Mmm. That was too tangy. Look here. You see that? And it says real fruit. Mm. Wow. But boy. That, you know, what is it called when it hits you right here? Like, ah. What is it called? Uh, get in the soap like sugar. tangy, sour here. Yeah. yeah. 
<laughs> okay. <laughs> Moving on to the next one mm. is from a brand called Benny and it's Benny Rindo. Benny Rindo. Mm. Benny Rindo. Benvenito? No, no. No, no, no. Oh, wow. It looks like it's Tamarindo as well. Mm. No, no, um, cousin. Oh, the cousin. Tam tamarind flavored, <laughs> candy filled. It's a hard candy like that like a hard candy and it has the tamarindo filling there mm. so they do come individual wrapped like that mm. let's see guys wait no you have my flashback do I dare show you this? You know what? I do dare you. This. <laughs> you can't even have it. You can't even have it. Looks like a soda bottle. This is what it looks like. Take it as you will. Okay, crazy do you want to taste them? I'll pass. Are you looking at it? Mmm. It has a, it has tamarindo, a good flavor. Taste. Mm -mm. I'm gonna crack it though because it says that it has a filling in there. Find out. There's only one way. <laughs> you don't crack your teeth now. Can you crack it? Uh-uh. Oh. oh. Would it be a surprise? Inside is very, very strong tamarindo flavor. Mm. But I don't see the... I mean, even though it says that it's filled with tamarindo, it's not that that like Sitty, no it's not like that um liquid filling it's like a hard filling inside mm. okay. hmm. but so far it has been the best candy yet on this test taste mm. 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 Okay. Mm. that was rather interesting that was it uh, the next one says peanut candy, marzipan, marzipan. no, marzipan style, dulce de cacachuate. Wow. Estilo marzipan. There's mm. six pieces. They look like this. Mm. And back here. It does say that it's a product of Mexico. I don't know if you could see the angle. But there it is. Mm. They do come. Uh, this is a six pack. And they do come individually wrapped. Just like that. And what it says is de la rosa. Um, Mazapan original. And it has like a little cute flower in the middle. Mm -hmm. That's just exactly how it looks. I don't know if it's a cookie. Pastry or what? A pastry or what. But I'm going to open one and we'll share it. Mmm. This reminds me of... Like a coconut puff. Like coconut like a pottery. Yeah. Mm. Mm. Oh, this is good. You don't like it? No. You don't like it? No. It just tastes like a lump of... Uh... Mm -mm. By far, this is the best one. A lump of dry sugar 
Like, um, wow, how can I describe this flavor? It just melts in a powder peanut yeah. in your mouth. Oh my God. Guys, I wish I could describe it to you guys. Okay. Is there anything here that... Mm -hmm. Like a milk, the, like a waffle. Mm -mm. No? I can't, ex I can't describe it, but you know what? Mwah. Okay. Next. Wow, that was delicious. The next one is from a company called Marietta. And it's a strawberry linzer shortbread cookie with fruit center. And you're all familiar with it. And it's this product right here. It's a six ounce box. And if you look at the side of the box right there, it's a product of Mexico. Mm. It does come in, I don't know, it, let me see. Hey. One, two, three, four, five, six individual um, two pack cookies. So I'm gonna open one and we'll each taste one. So the cookie looks like this with um, the strawberry filling in it. And this is the way it looks in the back with a shortbread cookie. Mmm. Cookie's good. Mmm. I could taste the shortbread. Mm. Mm. The strawberry is good. It's not too strong. It could be a little bit stronger, but it's good. Mmm. Mmm. Guys, this one is still my favorite. Look at it. Mmm. Mm. We only got two more items. I'm pretty sure you guys are familiar with it. It's from a brand called Num, And this is the veggie chips. And only a 0.7 ounce. Very, very small. With a little bit of product in it. But let me point out to you guys that it is a product of Mexico and it's in the carrot flavor. They look like this. Cheers. They look like that. Does it taste like carrot to you? Absolutely not. It's supposed to be like when you shave a carrot, a carrot but dried, like a dried carrot. No. But it doesn't taste like a, uh, a dried carrot because it says it right there. You see that dried carrot? No. Nothing is added at all. No. But... I would say as a thumbs, thumbs down. down. Yeah, absolutely. And the last product, it's from Known Fruit Chips Mango. Same um, amount of ounces, seven ounces. And once again, right here is a product of Mexico. You guys already know I got this at the Dollar Tree. I got this at the Dollar Tree, and I got this at the Dollar Tree. <clears throat> Let's try the mango one. <clears throat> and this is the way that it looks. I can I think there's two pieces in there. Mm. So it looks like the mango was sliced already mm. and it's dried. I think it's roasted. Cheers. I like this one better. I can definitely tell that it's mango. Yeah. You can't tell this is carrot at all. Mm -mm. And the flavoring. That mango is good. 
But this one. I would crush that and throw it on some ice cream. Mm. This one, guys, mm. you can most definitely tell that it has a mango flavor. If you want to eat anything with mango flavor, I would think this is the way to go. Mm. This tastes absolutely nothing like carrots at all. The mm. great thing is that it says here that it's nothing added. So they're basically taking the original mango and slicing it, drying it, and putting it in there. Mm. So there's nothing added to this. So th I would think that this would be a great snack. Possibly even for a diabetic with limitations because it's still got the natural sugar, but there's no sugar added to this. So mm. this would be a good snack um, for maybe diabetics. I think. I, I could be wrong. Correct me if I'm wrong. Mm. But I would think so. Mm. Okay, so, guys. Okay. I enjoyed these. These were spicy. <laughs> these were spicy to me. I enjoyed the candy. Thumbs up. And this was my favorite. Like right here. Sugar. Awesome, awesome, awesome. I'm excited that I received these. Um I'm definitely gonna see if I could get more mm. because I really did enjoy them. I hope that you enjoyed this video as much as we enjoyed making it for you and spending time with you guys because uh, as we are here, you are there, but we are still connected on our comment down below. Keep that communication between you and I and each other. I would love to read each and every one of your messages. If you have had any of these snacks or any snacks from Mexico, let me know what you think and which one you like best. So with that being said, that concludes this part of the video. Um, so guys, don't forget to smash that like, thumbs up the video, share the video, subscribe down below, hit that notification bell. That way you get notified each and every time I upload a video. Guys, it's getting rough out there. Don't forget to stay home, stay safe, uh, spend time with your family, be blessed, be happy. Most importantly, stay healthy. Don't forget to be positive, spread that positivity, and that positivity will always, always, always come right back to you.